Hi, Precious Art. Thank you for joining us for our weekly vlog. Today we are basking in the full embrace of a rare Aquarius blue moon. After the most accelerated shift of energy, vibration, and consciousness humanity or the Earth have ever experienced. According to the Company of Heaven, this monumental shift which has been unfolding in the realms of cause for millennia, was successful in ways that even exceeded the expectations of heaven. This unparalleled influx of light that allowed the immaculate concept of this facet of the divine plan to be victoriously accomplished began during the first Aquarius full moon as we entered the sun cycle of Leo on July 23, 2021. On that special day, the world was also blessed with the opening ceremonies of the Olympic Games. The global focus of attention on this event created a collective cup of consciousness that allowed the company of heaven to exponentially expand the violet flame of God's infinite perfection that perpetually flows through the portal of light above the sacred Mount Fuji in Japan. The organizers of the ceremonies created an amazing structure representing Mount Fuji and placed at the apex of this symbolic structure a sun when it was time for the Olympic flame to be lit, the sun opened, revealing within its heart center a brazier that would sustain the Olympic flame throughout the games. The beings of light revealed that the outer world vision, which represented the newly opened portals of the suns beyond suns, allowed the new solar light codes bathing the earth to be greatly amplified. On July 25th, millions of people around the world celebrated a day out of time, which is associated with a 13-month lunar calendar. Then on July 26th, they welcomed the Lunar New Year. This influx of light intensified throughout the days of the Olympic Games and paved the way for the opening of the Lion's Gate on August 8th. That event empowered every person's I Am Presence to strengthen our heart and intensify the courage within our heart flame. This event occurs during the sun cycle of Leo and the alignment of this star Sirius every year. Not by chance on that same day, we experienced the closing ceremonies of the Olympic Games. All of these events completed the recalibration of humanities, the elemental kingdoms, and Mother Earth's earthly bodies, which had been building in momentum day by day throughout 2021. This recalibration allowed Mother Earth and all life evolving upon her to withstand the unprecedented influx of light that was necessary in order to fulfill the divine mission for the 35th Annual World Congress on Illumination. That global event took place August 14th through the 19th and was God victoriously accomplished through the unified efforts of heaven and earth. In one pointed consciousness, with the assistance and deliberate participation of an awakening humanity, 
the collective I am presence of every man, woman, and child belonging to or serving the earth at this time co-created a quantum field of our Mother God's comprehensive divine love. This is the highest frequency of divine love humanity has been able to receive since our fall from grace eons ago. This quantum field of comprehensive divine love created a fluid field of unmanifest divine potential that allowed every person's I am presence to permanently encode within our heart flame the presence of unity consciousness. Our Father Mother God said this level of divine intervention is beyond the comprehension of our finite minds and has never before been allowed by cosmic law. Our Godparents said this is a gift of divine grace previously unknown throughout all creation. Now, all of these life-transforming events are being sealed in the eternal light of our Father Mother God through the blessings we are now receiving through the rare Aquarius Blue Moon. Our guidance from on high is for all of us to take the time to breathe and just assimilate the light and the wonder of what has occurred in all of our lives. By consciously breathing our elevated holy breath, which now pulsates with much higher frequencies of prana and our life force, we will gradually begin to realize how these events have transformed our lives and just what the presence of unity consciousness means for each of us individually and all of us collectively. The company of heaven has given us a simple but incredibly powerful exercise that will allow us to relax and just consciously breathe. This exercise involves the rhythmic holy breath. The rhythmic holy breath is very simple. It consists of four parts, the in-breath, then we hold the breath in, then we exhale, and then we hold the breath out. With each of the steps, we affirm the following statement within the silence of our heart. We begin by exhaling. Now, breathe in and affirm within your heart I am in-breathing God's pure source oxygen. Now hold the breath in and affirm within your heart, I am assimilating God's pure source oxygen. Now exhale and affirm within your heart, I am expanding God's pure source oxygen. Now hold the breath out and affirm within your heart, I am projecting God's pure source oxygen. Let's do that one more time. Exhale. Now inhale. I am in-breathing God's pure source oxygen. Hold. I am assimilating God's pure source oxygen. Exhale, I am expanding God's pure source oxygen. Hold, I am projecting God's pure source oxygen. Precious heart, during this incredibly powerful time, memorize this simple breath, and if possible, repeat it several times throughout your day. God bless you. I look forward to being with you next week.